I'll break iOS 8.1.2 using Taiji 1.2. As you can see on my iOS device, I am running iOS 8.1.2. This is my iPhone 5S. Uh, it is freshly restored here, which I do recommend that you do. It's a fresh in, uh, restore of iOS 8.1.2 and it is ready to be jailbroken. Now, just to preface this, you wanna make sure that you have your uh, passcode lock disabled and you wanna make sure that you are signed out of iCloud or at the very least that you have Find My iPhone disabled in your iCloud settings. Now, once you do that, you can go ahead and fire up your Windows machine. I'm assuming you're running Windows because this is, this is a Windows only jailbreak. Uh, so you will need a Windows box. If you don't have a Windows machine, then follow our tutorial that shows you how to set up a Windows virtual machine on your Mac. And it's super easy to do that. It takes like half an hour and then you can use that to jailbreak your device. But either way, whether you're running virtual Windows or you're running the real Windows, you can follow this jailbreak tutorial once you're up and running. So the first thing you want to do is connect your device to your, to your computer, obviously. And then you want to go to iDownload Blog's download page, which you can find here at the top of the screen. Just click this download link and then scroll down a little bit and then you will see the Taiji version 1.2 download. Just download that, save it to your desktop, and then you're good to go. Now, I have it saved here on my desktop. I'm gonna open that up, and I see the Taiji jailbreak, the English version, it's 1.2. You just wanna double click on that to run it, and select run, and there we go. So it's gonna start checking things out, making sure everything looks good. It does recognize I'm running iOS 8.1.2. It asks me to turn off Find My iPhone. I've already done that. Make sure you do that. Uncheck the 3K Assistant. That's a Chinese app store. You don't need that. You wanna close that out. Make sure Cydia is checked. And then just click the Start button. Super simple, super easy. Folks, I really do believe this is the easiest jailbreak outside of Jailbreak Me, which was unbelievably easy because it was done all on your device. You just went to a browser. If you don't know about Jailbreak Me, go back and do some research on iDownload Blog. That was by far the easiest jailbreak, but this one is second place, at least in my eyes. It's it's very easy. Uh, basically, just plug it in, you click Jailbreak, and you just wait. And uh, it's super easy. If you get this storage almost full air, just ignore that. Let it do its thing. Just You don't even have to touch anything. Just let it sit there and let it go through the Jailbreak process. It'll reboot, and it'll do its thing and eventually you'll be back up and ready. So on the Windows end, everything's done. It's that easy. It says, thank you for using Taiji jailbreak tools. Please enjoy your time now. So you can just close that out by clicking close. And folks, we're done on the Windows end of the page. The next thing you need to wait on is just wait on the uh, iPhone to boot back up and then you'll be able to use Cydia and run Cydia and enjoy your jailbreak. Super simple jailbreak, super simple. All right, so we're just gonna wait a little bit longer and just wait until things are completed. And I, I really do love this jailbreak uh, tool. It's so easy, so simple, and there's Cydia, just like that. Super simple, super easy. So all you do is you just tap on the Cydia icon, it'll prepare a file system, and there you go. There's your jailbreak, iOS 8.1.2 jailbroken using Taiji 1.2. Folks, doesn't get any easier than that. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Have you jailbroken iOS 8.1.2? Have you upgraded? 